You're going to have to wear a bubble around you so I don't jerk you up constantly. But... And we're live. I can't wait. Why? Oh, man. Ladies and gentlemen, it was foretold many eons ago on top of Mount Olympus, Zeus, king of gods, has decided to rub one out across the open skies of the universe. That very day, a woman, Karen, got a little sprinkle from the heavens above and became engorged with pregnancy. The father, Peter, only caring about beer, noticed his wife pregnant and did not care one bit and went back to drinking beer in the kitchen listening to Steely Dan. March 13, 1985, a demigod was born in a small city outside of Boston, Worcester, Massachusetts. It was said he was born with a gaming controller in one hand and Arby's in the other, and also a large penis in the other. He would go on to create the greatest gaming community in existence and become the greatest Overwatch gamer of all time. Also, don't forget about the penis thing. It's John John! My streams vary as much as my Steam library. I own more dice than one really needs. I am part of GGS, and you know we are the best. Rest assured, July 7th, we summon to be heard. Since the Supreme Stream team will be seen in the same room, that's how we do summer. <laughs> With a boom. We play games, but not Dota. It's Dakota. <laughs> I thought we were going a different way with this. <laughs> same. He likes to pretend that if he slightly excels at humor, it might overshadow his subpar looks and lifestyle. He may or may not have several different suicide packs with different people with varying circumstances. But don't worry, because it's like totally funny. Huh, <laughs> JK, guys, right? LOL? LOL, right? Okay. Um, and if he could somehow channel his alcoholism into something productive, he might be able to contribute to society. No, it's not John. Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a frag bitch. I have the biggest dick. I'm a widow in the streets and a mercy in the sheets. I wear hats. I can't write a decent intro anymore. I'm gonna kill myself with Jeff on a bouncy castle and during Scout's birthday party in February. Eat my body into the children's faces. It's Ariel. I'm 6'4", weigh 255. I enjoy when someone tells me that I'm bad at something or I did it wrong because it validates the voice inside me telling me I'm a failure. Probably because years of seeking approval from my father that I'll never get. And it caused me to self-destruct all of my relationships. Yep, just another like you with daddy issues. I heard it too. Uh, there are people way worse than me, so I'll stop bitching. Let's talk about games we're looking forward to playing, because one day we either won't care about games anymore, or arthritis will take over and we can't play. So let's remember the good times when we watch this again. Gaming and friends, I'm Jack. Oh my god, yes. Jeff, no, you went perfect. Everybody, that was glorious. <laughs> Shit. Shit. <laughs> 
You're like, mine's very, very specific. <laughs> it's weird, though, because I relate to it exactly. Oh, I also we all have do. Issues. <laughs> we all And that's why it's glorious. What is up, everybody? Welcome to the 2GS Show Glitches Get Stitches podcast, episode 74. Not 75, not 73, 74. Uh, it's a very special podcast day because it has been, I didn't even know this, Jeff earlier text the group he's like john you know what what day it is today and usually when someone asks you that question you say anniversary right like if you're in a relationship or something like that and someone comes up to you like do you know what day it is it's usually safe to say anniversary so i said I anniversary and then he was like yes and then so i was like got it right fuck i didn't give him anything though <laughs> we got each other the same thing anyway he showed this me this point. post <laughs> Disappointment. Yeah, yeah. He showed me this post three years ago, June 15, 2018. We started this podcasting venture. Um, and now here we are today with three more uh, team members on. And, and just GGS is awesome. And I just want to cheers to all you guys. Uh, Jeff, thank you for starting this with me. You guys, thank you for joining. Jack, Ariel, Dakota, this is like my favorite time to do shit is Tuesdays with you guys. So cheers and Ooh. thank you for making this happen. Cheers. Ooh. I'm drinking a mimosa. Jeff, is that a Dr. Pepper? Jack? Hmm. Jack, Jack didn't even raise, they didn't even raise a water. Ah, uh, there it is. <laughs> um, anyway. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This uh, this episode, we're going to shoot the shit a little bit, and then we're just going to jump into some E3 things. We'll watch some trailers, and we'll talk about it. Uh, you guys in chat, let us know some of your favorite games are that you saw at E3. Make sure that you find us on Instagram, Twitter, Discord, and our home Facebook. Like, share, hit that follow if you haven't already. I'll post if you missed the live podcast. The uh, uh, yeah. Uh, oh, you know what? We need a fucking poll, too. Anyway. Uh, if you missed the live podcast and you want to catch up on episodes you missed, sub for free at 4-Eyed Radio Network, iTunes, Spotify, and then go to our YouTube, Glitches Get Stitches YouTube for extra credit, uh, and watch the episodes that will be posted there uh, on that Friday after we live stream it on Tuesday. Also, Hulk Clap is at 100 and, 106,000. We're going for 200K, Jack! That, then I'll end it all. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be on uh, Scout's birthday or Sonny's birthday. Are you wait? No, I'll you... when I die. No, no, I'll, 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 I'll be gone before then. I, you know what? I didn't tell you guys, but I was gonna fly down again. Uh -oh. Let's go! Everyone's dying. Uh, Jeff, I just have a couple questions for you because you know we started this thing as a podcast first, and then it turned into uh -huh. this glorious thing as GGS. Did you ever think that this podcast would still be going strong? And GGS would be where we are today with a great community supporters, mods, and a fantastic team. No. I know that. I know that you didn't <laughs> think this. <laughs> no. <laughs> he was like, I'm going to do this bullshit with this bartender for about, I don't know, two or three weeks and then <laughs> fucking go somewhere else. And there was nowhere else to go. I slithered into your dark Jaegerfield heart, Jeff. That's what I did. I didn't say my room. <laughs> <laughs> Good. That one time. When I first met Jeff, this was his flex. He's like, look at all these Jaeger bottles I got. His kitchen was just a massive graveyard of just empty Jaeger bottles. The, the Jaeger Instagram reposted it, so yeah, there's one, there's I'm kind one. of famous. Oh, nice. Not a big deal. Yeah, Not we yet. should share that. NBD. I'll have to find it. Son of a shit fest. Um... Because you had your Jaeger poor thingy, and that's how you flex nuts. And some people are like, hey, look at my success as a human. You're like, hey, look at this darkness I have provided myself. In Girl, this look speech. at this thing I didn't even pay for. <laughs> <laughs> didn't even buy it. Um, but anyway, dude, it's, it's so awesome. I'm very, very proud of us. And just to think that all this came from the podcast, like, that's the craziest part. So anyway, I'm glad to be here. How are we all doing, Ariel? Starting with you, Hats McGee. Hey, hey, pressure, so much pressure. Where's the, where's the wine glass? 
Me and you are the only classy bitches here. Cheers. Hey. Close. Um, mm -hmm. Close. Perfect. You never have that class. So I, but I will take it back. You are a classy bitch today as well. Classy bitches. Classy bitches. Uh, Aaron. Um, yes. How's it going? Good. I, in my personal life, got a raise and a bonus. Woo! Ooh, let's had to, go. Had to fight tooth and nail for the bonus, but I did. Did you tell it. them about the GGS uh, thing that will murder everyone if they didn't give you the bonus? No, but they do all know that I have a podcast on Tuesdays, and they always ask me, "Are you going to work from home so you can podcast?" Ah, uh, and you say, "Yeah, I'll keep talking shit." I will. <laughs> yep. Um. So that was good, and then um. Chilling. Uh, yeah, uh, well, we watched E3 on Sunday, so that was cool. We watched the Xbox Bethesda showcase. Yes, um, and then I've yes. been playing a lot of Valorant, like usual. Nice, and I'm nice. Getting um, better. Valorant is uh is seems you guys are like kicking ass in it, so keep yeah. doing it, keep doing it. Jack, how you doing? Great. Fantastic. How's Summer Jack going? Good. I want to talk to you about a little thing called the new Ratchet and Clank on PS Five. So far, what do you think of it? Uh, it's fun. I've just been doing like the like collection stuff, like getting like different armors and things. Wait, I'm waiting for Thursday to stream it, so Is it's it's a lot of fun. Story? I haven't done that yet. No, I'm not since Friday. I think it's the last time I played oh, it. Nice, nice. Um, so I mean, like to me, all right. So you know how me and you are maybe the only ones that agree on this. How uh, uh, oh shit, what is it called? Uh, uh, what's it called? Demon Souls. Demon Souls, you know how me and you agree that that's like the cutting edge of how graphics should look on a PS5. Yeah. To me, Ratchet and Clank is also in its own way like phenomenal. Yeah. Really looking. I think you know what I mean. Like, I think it's easier for Ratchet to pull it off because it's it has that, that cartoony vibe. It's that cartoony art, like art style. Um, I think for Demon Souls, there's a lot more in Demon Souls that I was impressed with. In terms like the, of, the realness like it like like when you go to the first like um the first area and you like step in a puddle and like the sun like moves around along the water that was really cool um but ratchet yeah, has some really cool stuff and like i enjoy it looks really nice and like i would say yeah it was up there i i'm glad they kept it on ps5 like it's i i don't really enjoy when new consoles come out and then like everything's like on ps4 ps5 for like three years and then, like, yeah. I, I, even though it doesn't hold it back, I feel like it does. So, and yeah. I feel like the, all the guns have their own unique, like, triggers, which is really cool. Yeah, it is cool. Um, so I enjoy it. Dude, what, it, what, it, what, uh, what kind of, what's your favorite gun so far? Um, the, the electric one. Yeah, yeah. Or the, you know or the, or the recoil the time, one. The, um, Mr. Fun guy. I haven't got Mr. You Fun guy yet. No, not that far. I, no, I, this is like oh the first oh gun oh I got. oh the oh, yeah no I didn't I didn't buy that one. Whoa! Like, oh god, like dude. A mushroom gun or something? yeah, it shoots. Yeah, a little mushroom guy comes out and he, and he sounds like a stoner. He's like, "What's up, dude?" <laughs> and he like, wants a mellow mushroom. <laughs> yeah, and he sh and he shoots uh, enemies around you, and you can upgrade him. So I mean, he's doing like massive damage, and then oh, the so he's like on him. He's like the new Mister Zircon. Yeah. I've, 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 been, I've been waiting to get Mr. Zircon because like he like carries Who's Zircon. You. I don't know what that is. It's a uh, it's from it's like a one of like the OG gadgets you can get, like that and the yeah, buzzsaw are my favorite. Thing. The buzzsaw is like one of my favorite guns. But I don't know oh, if I'll get that or not. They have they have so many fun guns. They have one that uh, it turns into a sprinkler system and it hits the enemies and they like turn into a, a like this garden figure and you can fuck them up real quick, dude. I like. Yeah, they've oh, always had crazy stuff, and I think the PS5 like allows them to like do what they wanted to do on the PlayStation Two. I that's it's, it's, it's kind of cool to watch like what like the original vision for Ratchet and like how it's executed now because like it feels like what they wanted to do way back in absolutely. the day. Not, not that they didn't pull it off back in the day, but like it's just more actualized. And and they did pull it off back in the day because watching you play the first one, I had no idea it was like that. I didn't. I didn't know it had that. It was weapons. I didn't it know was they visually upgraded. Yeah, it was like fucking... visually, it looked better. Like they made, they made a PS4 version of it, but the PS2, it was just it's just like a graphical update to the PS2 version. So they did have all of that. Uh, so 
Nice. I got you. Yeah, anyway, it kicks fucking ass. And uh, so you'll be going back to that on Thursday. How, uh, how, how long do you think you got left in it? I don't. Think you one tap it or this Thursday or two tap it? I I might do Thursday Friday I think. Yeah, I cool. could be wrong, but I I honestly don't know how long the game is. I don't either. Depends on if my I think computer I might wants be a little to, bit further than you. If then. my computer wants to stream or not. It does. Mine didn't last week. Uh, we've all had problems. It's all fucked up. Uh, anyway, I'm excited to see you play that, and then afterwards, I take you'll be doing some more Valorant, so you whoop an ass on that, and that'll be fun. Or, or do you know what game you're gonna play after Ratchet? Um, I'll probably do like a Valorant week, and then go and do like um, the Sly Cooper games on my PlayStation Two. Oh, nice. That'll be kind of fun. Nice, nice, cool. Uh, Dakota. Bio mutant. Mm-hmm. Yep, yep. When are you finishing this? Uh, you know, I don't know. I'm honestly taking it really slow because there's a lot of stuff that I want to get. I like mounts and everything that are all side quest stuff for the most part. So I've been just kind of taking it slow, just doing some side quests off stream. Not touching. Are you really, doing uh, any of the main quest on the stream, or just still oh yeah? Side I've, I've, done, I've been doing honestly where I'm at with the main quest is like I have to do take over a lot of the uh, the tribes before I can really progress with other uh, main quests. So. Cool. It's a lot of it's like go here, collect five of these in this specific area. Go here, collect ten of these. Go here, find five. It's like so. It's a lot of go like, under this bridge, suck this guy <clears> off, and then and then oh, finding wait. five of his friends to you know. Is that a different with. game I'm playing? Yeah, Grand Theft Auto Four. Um, yeah. So uh, it's, well, it's how, how many? Uh, how long? How many more streams do you think you got in it? I don't know. I mean. If I really only do main, probably like two, three streams, maybe. Okay. All right. But I'm just right. taking it slow. Yeah. Cool. All right. Well, we'll see you on that. Jeff. Oh. Mm-hmm. That's tradition. Uh, first, I want to tell you I love you. And I wish I was sitting on your lap right now for our three year anniversary. Cross um, trip. I'll reach across. Through Ariel. I... <laughs> yeah. Around Ariel. Uh, stick. Where am I on the on the Facebook stream? Who is this? Oh, I have to go the other way. You Facebook both. Um, it, Dakota and I are between you two. I'm yeah. trying oh. giving a job, a hand job to you now. I just so object by accident. God. The ceiling. No oh God. <laughs> by accident. Go down. Go down. <laughs> down and to your right. Now you're directing off Dakota. Well, who? Hand jobs for all. Yeah. Hey, it's the three year anniversary. Dakota um, was thrilled. <laughs> this is better than Oprah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Jeff, let me talk to that sweet ass of yours for a second, all right? Oh, all righty then. Is this the Ace Ventura bit? <laughs> yeah. uh, all right, so you're on The Last of Us 2. I have wanted someone else to play this fucking game on the team f- since it came out. And I'm uh, not to play it. And you're alone. Jack bought it. And then he set it aside next to his Sekiro sword, and it's lost forever. <laughs> mm-hmm. That's what he thought <laughs> But I know you wanted someone to stream it. Yeah, I I did stream it when it came out, but I wanted someone else to play it just because it's an awesome fucking game. I'm having and a then, blast watching him play. I do too. I do too. So Jeff, <laughs> tell me a little bit about your experience with The Last of Us Two. How you feeling about it? Uh, you got the 60 FPS version. Uh, on PS5, how's it playing? Go. It's good. It's a <laughs> lot of story. Because I don't, for some reason, I don't, since I played the first one so long ago, I don't remember if it, had, it was like this much story. I felt like there might have been a little more action. But um, that could happen later. I'm not there yet. But it's a great. You have, you have, a, you have quite a journey in front of you. I will tell you that. Um, without spoiling anything. I'm. We're looking forward to Ellie and her roommate progressing. You know, they're just they're great, just roommate. They're great yeah. friends, and they were roommates. They're uh, they're like if me and you were roommates. They're good friends. You know, it's it's like that aunt you have in the family that's lived with her friend for forty years in a one bedroom apartment. You know, mm-hmm. great great friends. That's yeah. what they're gonna say about me and Bill, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I'm like it's Drunkle Jeff and Uncle Aunt Bill. <laughs> Why are they holding hands? 
They're best friends. Leave them alone. <laughs> Uh, what about what about like some of the combat and just the graphics and stuff? What do you think? Um, there, it's the combat's very it's very familiar, like for the first one. But I'm liking uh, the graphics. I was looking at some of it last night with the with the ray tracing and the rain. Mm -hmm. It was it was pretty freaking sweet. Isn't it insane, dude? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Uh, looking forward to it. The rest of the story and. I can't yeah. wait to see you go further in it. That's gonna make me so happy, Jeff. How much, how much longer do you think? Or how much longer is it? Oh, bro. I I took my time how you're doing it because, here, all right, so here's the thing. If you don't take your time, you're going to miss weapons because you gotta find all them yeah. shits. Oh, yeah, so, oh. um, you gotta, you gotta, uh, hold on, let me turn this down a bit, guy. Messed up something. All right, there we go. Um, I think I did it in 35, taking my time, yeah. like really taking my time. So I think you're at what, about 10, 15? Yeah, a couple more weeks of streaming then. Yeah, and you got, man, you got some good shit coming up. I can't fucking wait. Anyway, I'm proud of you doing that. I'm very happy. Um, hey, John, John, how you doing? Well, Hey, who was that? Who was that? Uh, someone asked if I was doing it. I'm doing great. Thanks for asking. I think it was Jack this time that asked me that. Colin said in the chat, I think. Oh yeah. Um, but I'm doing great. Overwatch is fantastic. Uh, on Sunday, Jordan had a hockey game. Lydia was working, and Annabelle said she might join in. So I just was like, you know what? I got the brand new Final Fantasy VII. Uh, inner grade for PS5. I'm just going to hop on that, and I played it for a good... I almost went for 12 hours, but here's the thing. Jack went for 12 hours, and that's the cutoff. I don't want to go for 12 hours and match you. You know what I mean? I either want to beat you, or, I'm, or I went... I went. I think I streamed like eight and a half hours that day. But you know what I mean, Jack? Like, Yeah. I'm sure... I'm, like, I, can't, I, I don't want to just tie you for 12 hours. I, if I go 12 hours, I want to go 13 or 14. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, I did a, I did a, I did a nice easy breezy nine hours on it, and it's it's good. It is it it it, it feels real good. I could I didn't know that the DLC for the Yuffie uh, stuff you could play right away if you wanted to. I didn't know it. I thought they had integrated it into the into the story, which. Um, they did in a way but they very much recommend you play the story again but me i just want to play the story again to experience it in 60 fps and see how they fix they are they upgraded all the whole thing and then i'll move to the dlc even though i'm like good 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 because this will be my my fourth playthrough of it yeah so i really want that new dlc content baby but i'm gonna do it the slow way i'm gonna do it the slow way um, but yeah, that'll be fun. And then I've been playing Ratchet and Clank in a total dark, so my eyes can just glaze over at the awesomeness that it is. Oh, you guys, today we're just going to talk about some E3 things. Dakota? Momomo main segment. Eggment. Eggment. Um, we're just going to hang out. Have some drinks, watch some uh, trailers on some new games. We highlighted one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of uh, the most standout games in, in our eyes. If we missed anything, let us know in chat and we can always pull it up. But, um, Jack, if you want to get that started and that screen pulled up, we will go into the first one. It's going to be Outer Worlds 2. So, uh, I, I have missed a lot of E3 stuff, not the on purpose. The best trailer ever made for a game. Are you saying this for a reason or just because it really... Hands down. No, hands down the best trailer I've ever seen for a video game. I am excited to watch it then. See? <laughs> That's my excitedness. Right, nice. Jeff? Jeff's I don't like it. For. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. Next time you come up for your birthday, to Jeff, you a birthday like stream. Old, wise sounding voice. What? When we see a quiet, what are you pointing at? Peaceful. 
Are you not watching the stream? Oh, I'm shit! Pay I'm saying pay attention! Hey, no. <laughs> I thought you were ready to go, my bad. Um, I'm on it. You might need to turn- is it as high up as it goes for YouTube? Because it's kind of quiet. Yeah. It'll yeah, be louder turn. on my stream it's going to like my desktop audio, but it, you might have to boost it on your end. Yeah. Alright, so we got the Outer Worlds 2. Alright, 3, 2, 1. Start it over. Okay. Oh my god, an Xbox sign? Yep. This will make our game seem big and important. Now, something must break the serenity. Uh, will this creature be in the game? No. Say goodbye to a friend. <laughs> Suddenly, and for no reason, people running. <laughs> slow motion shots make everything seem cool and should bolster pre-sale numbers. <laughs> oh my god. sound can mean only one thing. We must gaze over an epic shot of a world. And there should be lens flares. Now we see our <gasps> hero. But only the silhouette, because the developers haven't finished the design. <laughs> or finished any gameplay that's actually ready to show. In fact, the only thing they have finished is the title. <laughs> what? <laughs> Dude! Ariel, I, I I didn't know I didn't know if you were like being facetious or like <laughs> no, it's incredible. Holy shit! Was, all right, all right, okay. Who played the first one? I did. I did. I, is it this awesome game that we're all sitting yes. on? I loved it. I was so it, it was just it was just happiness from start to finish. Not even happiness. It just was satisfying. It, yeah, it was, it was just well done. Game. If you like yeah. Fall, Fallout New Vegas, that you this is yes, the game exactly. To play. And it it's made by Obsidian. It took me back to New Vegas. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it was the same devs as Obsidian. You have a lot of like, like, you kind of feel like there's loyalty to them because they broke away from everyone yeah. and they did their own thing, and it's really good. And this is going to be even better. It looks like. I mean, I I didn't have a interest in this game, but I do now because of that trailer. I yeah. it's. I just want to go back and play the first one again. Same. Also, in the game, there's a lot of that sarcastic humor in the dialogue and stuff. Like, I would do, hope so. If they... It comes through, yeah. Damn, that is, that's awesome. I, uh, Jeff, are you any into that at all? Uh, maybe. I don't know. There's, I've got so much coming out. That do you I have a lot of here. going in? No. Exit oh. only. <laughs> I, I loved it. I love that trailer. Damn, we should have did that one. I mean, because that was it. Really was good. It really was I told good. You. Jack, is this a game that you that you're interested in or? Nah. Um. Well, so I didn't play the first one. I'd have to buy this and buy and play. So Dakota, Dakota, you streamed it. Mm-hmm. I, I can't I remember your stream. how. Huh? Because I got I watched. I remember before I joined GGS, I actually was really excited about this game, and I watched Dakota's stream, and it just had helped me decide to buy it. That's GGS. Um, uh, is it? I mean, what is it? Destiny? Is it Destiny-ish? No, no, like... no, it's more like Skyrim. Uh, like like those type of games, like where you have dialogue that you choose to do a customized. We there's uh, different weapons, different uh, fucking outfits and shit. It's um, it's super fun. Damn. It's like if you shot Fallout into space. Honestly, yeah. it's got the same dynamic. Yeah. It's about. It's like it's like a commentary on like war and. I don't know. It's it's really good. No, that's hey, it's really that's good. The guns okay. are awesome. Yeah, it's fun. So is that a hey, Xbox buddy. exclusive? Yes. Or is really? it a, it's a Microsoft exclusive. Microsoft exclusive. Yeah. So it should so be on be, PC. Yeah. But yeah. Okay. Well, all right. Well, now we're getting this. All right. So this next one, another uh, another my or Xbox Halo Infinite. They dropped a new thingy thing. I'm gonna go over to the live video. And we'll check that bad boy out. 
And hey, everybody. For us, and I hope many of you, Halo has always been about heroism and wonder. Heroin? About fighting to keep humanity safe yes. against impossible odds in a hey, beautiful a female and character. mysterious sci-fi world. <laughs> this is just one part of the Zeta Halo ring, the largest, most wide open environment we've ever built. And we can't wait for you to explore it. Yeah, but did y'all fix that motherfucking design on the enemy? The heart of Halo is Spartan 117, the Master Chief. Let's go. In the next chapter of the Chief's story, you'll face his greatest challenge yet. But you're not alone in the fight. Oh, the main batteries are shut down. We're stuck out here. I know that voice. Who is it? Uh, I believe it's, it sounds like Raj from fucking uh, Big Bang Theory. I don't know the actor's name, but. You have oh, okay. Yeah, I know who you're talking about. An entire army. What can you do? I could be wrong about I told you. It's enough. So I see. Gun. If you knew how you were going to die, if how would you live your life that would hit you differently? Black and sweet. What happened? Where is Cortana? The rogue oh! ally known as Cortana is gone. She's been deleted. Are you? Of course not. Did you hit your head or something? Don't you remember? My instructions were to enter this installation, imitate Cortana, and lock her down for retrieval. Yours were to take her back to the Infinity for deletion. So if it wasn't you... Oh, shit. Okay, then. There's something else. On successful deployment, my deletion routine was supposed to complete. Still here. <laughs> Good. Good. Something stopped your deletion. We need to find out why. But this wasn't the mission. The missions change. They always do. Are you sure? Yeah, they do. What's Halo gonna do now? <laughs> <laughs> What's Halo gonna? <laughs> oh man, dude, that gave me some of uh, the feels. Uh, I know, me too. All right, who all here has been a Dakota's? I've played yeah. every single fucking Halo there's been <laughs> multiple times. Um, Ariel's got her hand up. Jeff, Jack, were you ever into Halo at all? I right, never had an Xbox. Yeah. So here's the funny thing is that I used to work at a toy store, a toy store when I was younger. Here's the second funny thing. Uh, you went to a toy store? It was in a mall. Stuff. They oh, let okay. you in a toy store? An adult toy store? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. It was for kids. We That's sold Thomas the Train. We sold like the off, well, the better high quality brands to rich kid uh, toys. Like uh, fucking. The roller coasters you build yourself, Thomas the toy trains, uh, like robot shit like that, you know. Anyway, when I worked there, uh, Halo came out, and my buddies they all had it, and we'd go to his house and we'd set them all up. And we had a LAN party. That was first my Halo? first LAN party ever. It broke my it pop broke my cherry. <laughs> I'm a butthole cherry. Uh, of that <laughs> and I, the thing is is we played it all the time and then after that little shindig fizzled out i never played any of them again 
I never had I never had uh, Xbox. Maybe for a little bit, but I didn't really play it. Uh, but I want to play this. Dakota, are you excited for this? Oh yeah, uh, I'm excited but nervous because Halo Five was, in my opinion, awful. Mm-hmm. Uh, I really want them to go back to like Halo Three and Reach, where like you're. It was a little bit slower of a game as it should be. Um, and, like and like all the weapon mods and stuff aren't there, which I wasn't really too into. I liked that it gave you certain things that, as far as reach it was nice because it gave you a run option and a couple smaller option but like five just went a little too too overboard with the the armor uh the so the so what, what where do they need to hit this one a little bit less of that and a little bit more i'm hoping they just kind of slow back with not too many too many like different armor <laughs> class i like options you can choose from ariel are you gonna get this game uh, most likely, yes. Um, I, same thing for me, like, what you were saying. It's, like, Halo was my first experience with, like, playing with people. And, like, the, the big, my friends would, like, ha- host huge parties. And we'd be, like, I remember it was, like, you were assigned a room. It's, like, you'd be in the awesome. living room or the bedroom or the basement. And that's where you'd go with your team. <laughs> and then, like, that's it was like so the much bathroom. fun. Yeah, I was the only girl, so I, I was pretty much no. I uh, we lit. Anyway, I got bullied because I was terrible. I have. Who I fucking very, cares? You were still there playing. I know, but it Dude, made it all girl. better when I killed them. Anyway, nice. yeah, it was annoying. But girl. I think Jack and I are going to play through the Halo games. And are you? His, oh yeah. Yeah, That's for awesome. his first for his first Halo experience. That'd be awesome. I is it I will, co op the whole yeah. time? It's, you, it's the, up to four players. Actually, Dakota, you can answer oh. this for me because I didn't play the first two, the and first, I don't think actually, one yeah. and two are co-op. I they're think it's co-op, but three. they're not. They're not four player. You you can play okay. co-op on the on the first two. No, me but Shal- I mean, no, I meant it. sorry, I meant the um campaign. Yeah. Not. There's yeah, four can, player co-op campaign. I and I think in the third people. one there's four, but uh, in the first two you can do. I could be wrong on that, but for sure there's uh, two player co-op. Me and Sean, I, I, I did that for a couple of streams with Sean. We were trying to beat the first one on uh, Legendary. Yeah. Nice. Well, we won't be doing Legendary because Jack has never played, and I can't guarantee that my skills on old games is anywhere. Um, are this you guys playing on PC? This is first person shooter. You'll yeah. be all right. Yeah. No, I know. I've, pl- I've played it. But There's very just... little jumping involved. Perfect. Uh, <laughs> no, there is, but there is sometimes. That's what I, I mean, remember. Very jumping. <laughs> you got a rocket or you got a, a sticky, yep. you jump. Yep, exactly. Yep. Uh, Dude, I didn't know that. That's fucking awesome. I used to play, uh, me and uh, Sir Platypus, man, back in the day, we would we would go to his house and I was thinking we'd play homies. for, we, yeah, right? We, we, we would play for hours, man. We would we would play uh, just competitive, like, against other teams and shit. Uh, I haven't owned the I Xbox 360, the fucking Halo Master Chief Edition one. It was all green and everything. It was awesome. Yep. I, I, I hope this guy isn't watching right now, and I don't think he is, but the guy who hosted the LAN parties smelt like the inside of a turd burglar. Because <laughs> he was like one of those nerds that just... Didn't shower? But I love him. That's not and I'll Anyways, eat, main I'll eat the cake out of his belly button, but... Ew. Okay. <laughs> Alright, Jack. Ready for the next one? Yep. I'm here to kill chaos. That's my mission. <laughs> Looks like chaos has been waiting for us. <laughs> I think I'm going there to find you. I guess we'll just show ourselves in. John has to buy I it now. I only know one thing. I want to Jack, this is it, baby! Chaos. We need to. It's not a hope or a dream. It's, it's like Devil May Cry-ish. Thirst. Move but I'm aside. getting little vibes of. Yeah. You're dust. <laughs> He's mad. You, sure chaos is you don't say yeah. you're yeah. dust you know, to someone before you so kill long. them and turn the them into dust? What are you doing? This is the shrine. I don't know. 
He's here. Ice? We just have to hunt him down. Feel the pain! <laughs> Feel the pain, Jeff! Feel the cringe. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Cringe? Ah, no oh, so cringy. What are you guys ripping his mouth open with fire? Yeah. It was a night. It's it's don't dialogue. talk while you do it. Yeah. <laughs> this is Final <laughs> Fantasy VII. You talked the whole time. Or Final shirt, Fantasy like One. You talked the whole time during combat. Chaos. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> you have to yell the enemy's name before he strikes you. <laughs> Crush you! <laughs> no one you're beaten! And who are you? You should. I, I play this only in Japanese. We're here so to kill here to hear chaos. The prophecies. No, no. I want it. I want it double dubbed in English. He always wore such splendid armor. With a helmet that was <laughs> some pointy shoes. <laughs> it's cool. He was so handsome. No. Look at that fucking Chaos. helmet, bro. <laughs> it's the Lich King. <laughs> Damn, baby! Strangers of Paradise? I'm just gonna turn down and just dub it myself. <laughs> me, me so happy for this. Me so happy for this. Okay? Let me tell you three reasons why. Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy, okay? Jeff, I know this is on your radar. <laughs> But how are you feeling about that intro or that trailer right there? That, that like that that's probably taken like some YouTube ideas I've had, and, but they're serious about it. Yep. <laughs> like, <laughs> I want to make parody videos, right? Yes. Like that. It's a parody. It's exactly. And they're but they're real about it. Okay. Let like I want to like want to like walk in like when you worked at Ice Den, I'd be like, John. Village <laughs> camera changes yeah, and, and I, shit. And I pour the Jaeger and I throw it at you. <laughs> yeah, that's what's badass. You don't I'll like show you how to drink this movies from where they go crane before they fucking fight people and shit. Drink now. Yeah. Yeah. I'll... <laughs> you don't like that? Don, yeah, you that do is like that. Hilarious. I think it's hilarious. It's funny. Uh, this is real life, okay? It's a Final Fantasy 1 remake. A lot of people are very angry about this because it didn't go exactly with Final Fantasy 1. I like that the way it went. Okay? Jack, how many copies of this are you going to buy? At least four. I see. There we go. I don't know. Hey, is that true? That's no. sarcasm, right? I don't, okay. No. I can always no, tell no, when, no. When, the, when, when the game is uh, does voice acting, Square Enix or Capcom, they're they're usually pretty cringy. Yeah. Did you play the the newest Devil May Cry? Was it? No, Devil. not the, not the newest newest one that you had. Five, I think it was. Not that. I don't it's fucking that awesome, man. Who cares if they fucking say everything they're doing? Ultimate punch, and then do the. You know, they're just letting you know that you're doing it. I know, but they. It's I press X. Is, I know what I'm doing. It's a special, <laughs> just the way it's. Ariel's it's writing weird. notes. What yeah. is she? Is she writing fuck Final Fantasy one? Yeah, I think she's writing her uh, letter to quit GGS. <laughs> I'm yeah, my resignation letter. She's seeing how many Sign different fonts she can write yeah. cringe in. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, Dude, I'm fucking stoked for this. I remember I text Jack yesterday about it, and he didn't even text me back, so that's how I know he was stoked about it. But I uh, didn't even leave you on red. He probably just saw your name and was like, nah, I'm not going to look Oh, he you. definitely ignored it, but it does, he is not excited for this game. He didn't know how to tell me it without hurting my feelings, but it's all right. It's all right. I'm thick skin, baby. I'm thick skin. Uh, on to the next, Jack. I don't want the next Jack. I want Summer Jack to say. Oh, yeah. Same. Oh, great. Oh, is this. God damn it. Even oh, better yeah. than the last one. Did Just... I? Medios is going to so save it. Of me. Do you know what a birthright is, Peter? No. Oh, this is the new uh, Avengers DLC? You've already had it. No, it's a game. Let's just look at it with open minds, god damn it. Oh, I've already watched it. 
I know. In 30 it's, minutes with an open mind. Well, hey, at least you get to listen to Matt Mercer talk. Rocket. So I let Groot fill out the paperwork. <laughs> what they call them? The Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so the enemies, okay. All right, is this gameplay right here? Yeah. All right, all right, all right. You want monster? I'll show you monster. No, we just rove. Keep your pants on. Oh, we could be used as a distraction. All right, that was a big joke. I like it. Annabelle, that I don't know. Oh, she looks good though. Notifications are just not working. They're not working for anybody on Facebook right now. Osmo. Osmo. Was uh, Groot holding an Alpha? Alpha right there? Alpaca? Alpaca? Oh, that's me. Look like a fucking. He okay, banged so that's my question too. Like, Where was it? Did it not have the right? At the very end. Where they're all standing, yeah, after this. Right there. Yeah, he's definitely oh, hold, yep. hugging oh, yeah, an alpaca. alpaca. Alright. Orange hair. Nice. Little, little, uh... I like it. I like it too. It's like uh, carrot top, but a llama. Right. <laughs> Cute. Uh, are, we, are we done? Are we done with it? Yep. 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 Oh, so... I'll tell you what, I'm fucking scared of this game and so many different levels, but here's what I want to ask the group, okay? All of us played Outriders. That's the first, that where we all got our hands on a game, you know what I mean? But all of us played Outriders, Square Enix. Uh, one, two, three, four of us played Avengers. I think Jack played maybe the demo. Nope, I didn't even do that. Oh, you didn't, you didn't play it at all? Nope. Three of us played Avengers. Three of us beat Avengers. Um, Jeff, where's the combat? What you're seeing very quickly, where's the combat? Is it a mix between Avengers and Outriders? Are we having a little more space for the battles, or what's going on there? What do you think? No, they didn't show. I watched part of the combat trailer that they actually had out. It's completely different. Like, you, you play as Star-Lord only. So you don't get to switch to Drax, or Gamora, or anybody else, I but like you, that, can, to be you can you can you can have them do stuff though. Like when you saw him, when you saw Star like shoot and Drax jumped up and kicked. Yeah. You okay. you like you give you commands to the team for them to okay. use skills. Okay. That's, okay. that's as far as that goes. Have you seen the combat on the new Final Fantasy that I'm playing, where it's where I'm let's say I'm Cloud. I'm hitting them. I can press R two and have Aerith put a spell on me. Is it like, am I st like, you, is it that kind of thing? You don't actually switch to the character though. I think you can. They... You yeah, can this. You don't. Switch, or you can choose just to tell them what to do. Then you just tell them. Okay. It'll so slow they're... down. It slows down a little bit. I think it shows. It'll be like, like the the D pad is like assigned. To each, one to each person. Okay. So you'll hold left, it'll bring up Gamora's skill set, and you'll be like, whoever you're looking at, kind of, you push one of the buttons and she'll use a skill. Or if you hold up, you can tell Drax to do something to somebody. Kind of thing. All right. Do you think we're leveling them up as we go, or are they kind of leveling up with us? What do you think? These are all just premonitions on what I think. think. I think uh, it'll be like probably. followers in Diablo. 
maybe you could find like a trinket to give them or something. No, you don't I'm think thinking so. Thinking you level up, you level up their talent. I'm thinking like they'll have like their probably, own skill tree. You probably Unlimited. have a different one to choose from. I feel like you'd be like, okay, do I want Gamora to be like a tank or do I want her to be like a heal? And like you probably have a small skill tree that you level up based based on that, like tank or healer. They'll all have small skill trees, I'm guessing, and Star Lord, you'll have the biggest one. Uh, Dakota, you have played Outriders and you have played Marvel Avengers. Are right, what's your, what is your excitement for this game? Um, lack thereof, to be honest. Because uh, it, it just looks, right. it looks like Avengers, in my opinion. I mean, I haven't watched Combat, so. Did you hate Avengers? No. Did you hate Outriders? Definitely not. How many hours did you put in Avengers? Uh, probably. Eight, eight for the camp, the, the the campaign, and you streamed it for, for three the... hours, and you beat. I beat the game in eight hours. hours up. I'm just kidding. You probably what put like thirty hours in, probably. Not even that much. I don't know. Probably not even twenty hours, dude. The campaign, and then I played some of the offline stuff, and I was like, it's it it was it, it wasn't fun to me after that. It got boring. Um, how many hours did you put in Outriders? Probably close to seventy, maybe more. Okay, so that's not bad. I don't think Outriders is a bad game. I Not think that it's a game you play once, and I'll probably never. After I saw you do the uh, the after game shit, what are they? The the expeditions, ex expeditions, expeditions yeah. and it wasn't really anything that more exciting to me. The game is done, but I probably put around 60, 70 hours into it. Jeff, how many hours you put in Marvel? I've I've been... it, and I've been playing the DLC as it comes out. So, so a hundred plus, probably yeah. Yeah, Outriders. How many hours? Um, I should probably pull that up. Steam, right? Mm-hmm. Mine's on Xbox, so I don't, can't even do that right now. Yeah. Twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. Yeah, I beat it. Okay. So, with these two games. Square Enix is trying to hone in. Obviously, they have they have the Marvel fucking copyright, right? They, they, they're they're going to be making Marvel games. This is the people that are going to be making Marvel games. Well, how, are like, you excited this is for this? Nothing, like, I'll get this. Sure. I'll get it for sure, too. They're Anyone just, else? But it's Eidos Montreal. Like, they did, like, Batman, like, Arkham City. Like, they're not fucking, oh, no, like, okay. you know, Avengers. And, like, that's just... Square Enix and a different company I'd never heard of. Yeah. Like, Eidos Montreal's been around. They've made, like, solid stuff before, so. Jack Ariel interested in this at all? Yeah. No. It, it's, it's, a it's a tough sell. I feel, I mean, okay, it's not a tough sell because it's Marvel. They're going to sell as much as they need to make money. What it is, is if you've played the last two titles, is you you're gonna be nervous going into this game, but I mean I'm gonna buy it. It is what it is. Jack, set us up for the next one. They did Shadow of the Tomb Raider. Oh, oh really? okay. okay. Why are we showing this, Jack? This doesn't look any anything good. Yeah, it looks it looks really lame. I don't know. I don't even know who is excited for this. Next sec. I'm software. The time has come. Will soon return. That's a red witch. Guided by grace. Once lost. What's up, Kyle? Dude, it's gonna be oh, like sick. it's gonna be like an open world secret, which is already an open world, but it's gonna be more open world. Get a fucking turtle with the bell. On. Oh! 
Conjured up some souls. Fucking sick. Brandish the Elden Ring. For all of us. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Jack. Jack. Oh, God. That's a. Hey. Uh. There's no one to talk about. Hold on. Oh god. Hold on. That was Jack! I'm coming to you on this one, man. I'm coming to you on this one, man. This is you. This is you. From software. This is also me now. You have made this a me thing, okay? Uh, but first, how excited are you for this game? I actually almost cried watch when I was like when it was, when it was like getting released, I was like so happy. Like that's all I wanted out of E3 was like uh something about Elden Ring. And we got a release yeah. date too. Okay, so from the Souls game, you are a Souls game expert, a, a Demon Souls. To me, if you beat that motherfucker in twenty five hours, as much as I fucking hate you, I want you to know I respect you. It's a hatred peppered with respect, okay? But it's insane. So this is your type of game, but here's what I'm seeing from this. I'm seeing a lot of little secret little action, right? And and there's one fella in here that got a very far in secret, and there's one that didn't. And that's you, Jack. So what do you think? What do you think the combat's gonna be like? Is it gonna be roll, 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 or is it gonna be parry heavy? Because that's what secret was. Parry, parry, parry saves a fucking day. You can just spam that shit. You know what I mean? yeah how do you think the combat's gonna be on this um from what i've read they talked about how stamina will be less of an influence so oh, it'll God. which i personally was kind of like mad about because i enjoyed like having to like work with that and like challenge myself so you like, like to roll twice and be halfway out of stamina and get slapped in the fucking dick with a sword it, i mean it made it harder it was it was more fun for me to like like learn because you, you had to like learn sequences of bosses and like when they would like swing you roll swing you roll and then like time your swings with that so like it was more of like a it mentally engaging for me to play like i liked having to like i can't just like keep spamming like attack like i had to like think about if it was like time to like dodge or like bear down and take a hit um or just swing your massive r2 giant sword at them yeah so i always play with claymore so i was happy to see that they they were kind of like they had at least had those in the game but they're also talking about that you've got a claymore in demon souls after 25 hours and i've been playing for 50 hours and i still can't find a claymore that's the fun part anyway back to you jack i mean all you have to do you can buy one in voluntaria like it's it's like literally the second area you go to like after you beat the little like uh i forget the name of the boss the felix the yeah I've beaten like, him. Yeah, I know you did. After you beat him, if you go where the dragon is, and then you go underneath the stairs, the tunnel, and you can go down that tunnel, and you have, like wolves that chase you, you just like kill the wolves, and once you like clear yeah. that out, um, there's a there's a merchant all the way at the end of it that'll sell you a claymore for uh, six thousand souls. So I probably souls. just didn't have enough money to buy it, and I forgot about it. Probably. Also, blue knights dropped them. I think, or no, I think it's red knights dropped them. Um, awesome but the combat they talked about how like they want it to be more inclusive for all weapon types so i like that a lot so you can like 
Let's see, you so find a lot of switching weapons instead of just running with one. Well, it's kind of like like if you find like a really cool sword, but you're like using like magic, you kind of like fucked. But in this, and supposedly this one, like they they're they're opening up options for players to like use more abilities and more like skills and swords and stuff. And then also the thing yeah. you pointed out with the souls, you can actually collect like fallen souls and then summon them basically Pokemon to fight with you. Okay. So if you're like really stuck on a boss, you can go and like farm like some powerful souls and then like have them fight with you. Which oh, is pretty cool. Shit. You got some help coming in. Yeah, and then it'll be there's like you can you can't access everything at first, but you can go to like like along the way, like you saw how big it is. Along the way to like where your yeah. the main mission is, you can go to like different castle like sub castles that aren't really like you can just find stuff in them like it's like it's like you can just go explore the world there's not like a set like like even in demon's world it was like you go here 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 and you're done here here and you're done yeah. this and this one it's going to be like you go to this world and then you can just go wherever you want inside there like there's open world yeah are you into this dakota um it's fucking stunning looking and it looks are you are, are you into the dark i remember I you saying you were really played, into the dark I've, souls it's not that i've I, i'm not really into them but I, because because i never played them and like i don't play games to like stress out of play, play secret room stress i played it for a little bit it was really hard and i just couldn't get past a certain area and i was like this is like this isn't really fun like i want to i like the the, i like the challenge like, and i'm okay with the challenge but like i also <laughs> like to think that i am good at video games but obviously i play these games and i'm like i am no. trash <laughs> these games will make you yeah I, I feel like helen keller yeah <laughs> but i mean like as far as i'll probably i'll probably get it because of uh it's gonna be a, a impulse buy for sure uh but and then you'll it, hate your life after 10 minutes i don't know man i really want to i really want to try it and, and i want to at least try to get i think you should i mean honestly it looks like they're going more towards um they even talked about with like george r R. martin writing the mythos for it there's there's more like i even forgot about that part there's even there's a there's more like it's more like story driven than the other ones are which i don't know how i feel about it because one of my favorite parts about dark souls is the fact that like there is no like there is a story but you have to like try really hard to follow it or it's just like you're killing shit yes I have, two, I have two questions. Yes. One, this doesn't have anything to do with this game has nothing to do with Dark Souls, right? There's no crossover. No, it's just people who made okay. Dark Souls. This is what I think. Then, compared. have you heard anything else about that red-haired, awesome female Valkyrie? That, Supposedly, yeah. she's called Valkyrie. That's all I know. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, I know she was in the first trailer, so oh, I know she, I know she'll be very important. And I don't know if she was killing an NPC or killing like your character. I don't know if she. I, don't I was like, gonna say, do you know if she's good or bad? like i don't know yet um i i know the world is supposed to be um inhabited by like the bosses are um demigods so like basically it's kind of like there's the tar so everyone was empowered by the golden uh, or the yeah, elden Demi-Jong. ring but the elden ring gave everyone powers and like the trait of that was everyone's like eyes were like golden and then um the elden ring broke and then some like uh, people started to become tarnished which is kind of like um the hollows herpes mm-hmm. sounds like lord of the rings honestly the hollows right, yeah, who's writing it i know they all think alike the biggest okay real quick jeff does are you interested in this? no okay uh <laughs> jack nope <laughs> uh this is a huge game and me, I feel like me and you are going to be the front runners for the. Are you going to stream this game, or is this thing you want to go on the side piece? I'm not streaming it. This will be for me. So I could stream this game. Yeah. Here's what else I have for you. I I I, I have a duel with Jeff. It when when uh, Overwatch crossplay comes out. I have a duel with you, sir. I think that I will beat this game faster than you because i'm seeing a lot of now? secret oh, i'm seeing a lot of money secret on or... hey, but when and, I, and I will wager i will wager i will true. wager a very nice mandate yeah but jack might take it slow to actually like See, enjoy but what the if he story doesn't want to, yeah to speed no, jack doesn't care about I, no 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 jack i, I know how case. jack games Jack speed runs situation. without even speed running. I know how fucking Jack plays. He, this is his favorite game ever. He'll beat it in fucking 30 hours. I'm going to beat it in 29. Okay? Okay. I can take my time and still beat you on this one. You, di- you didn't finish Secro. 
I will take me. Yeah, he didn't even beat Sue. Would you fucking bring up Sue? You know how fucking far I got? This goddamn huge ass fucking thing. You kill, you slice off his head, and then guess what? He picks his head up and he. You he only got to the monkey. Dead head. You only I'm, got to the monkey. I thought you got way further. Than Thirty that. hours in. I'm okay. The monkey's thirty hours in. I thought you got to the final I'm, boss. There's, yeah, there's, I thought you got to the last boss, and then you couldn't. No, do it. there is one last stage that I have not got to because I kill the monkey boss and then I go underneath him to this next stage. That's the I have not got to the last stage. Okay. Of Sekiro, but I have put fifty hours into this. I have but 35, 40 hours. So I can take my time. If it took you fifty hours, hours if it took if it took you fifty hours to get there, then I can take my time. Okay. All right. And if and if you beat me on it, that's great. I I just I hope that you enjoy it, and I hope you have a good time with it. That's all I want out of this. I want people to like enjoy these games because they're so beautiful. Like I love them so much. Like they're like the soundtrack, like everything about it. Just I'm in awe playing them. You didn't ask me, John, but I am planning on playing it. <laughs> you, well, you so. can't even jump, so I didn't know you could dodge. I'm waiting. <laughs> I don't play Senua. I had to dodge a lot. That was that was not. The hardest part about seeing you was lining up those fucking puzzles that I. I I'm like, what is this? Why is no, the power you, the power you use your brain? I think no, the uh, no, the, the way they had dodge. it set up. I can dodge. Uh, Listen, maybe I'll stream the music it. for that. Cool the music for that trailer. Can we just talk about like I, the music in it? Like yeah. the music in that trailer was beautiful. Like it was I like, know. like when he like summons like the horse. Like, he like jumps in midair and just like spawns under. Oh my god! Or honestly, I think my favorite part was the dragon like swinging the lightning at them and then like jumping over the lightning with that like dad. Like, oh, dude. Yeah, I, I, dude, I'm excited for it. No, I'm going to have a blast with this, and I'm going to take it slow. If, by chance, I end up beating you, beating it faster than you, um, you know, we'll see. We'll see. It's a little side bet of, okay. of the fun. Fun comes first, little side bet. All right, hit the, hit the next one. I didn't have that actually pulled up. That's it. The, this is the, the only game I care about. I mean, other, I guess the next one I care about too. But like, <laughs> do you want to? You can talk some more about it. No, I'm. I. 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 I don't want to take up the whole plot. Like, I literally. That's all. I, like, that's all I've talked DT, about for the talk, past DT, year. You can talk a little bit more about it for uh, three minutes while I go piss real quick. If you need to. Well, I, I don't want to miss the next we, trailer. We can, we can easily talk about this game. All right, bye. <laughs> no, I'm. I'm very excited for all of it i'm i can't wait to see what the weapons are going to be like because it looks a little bit more like high fantasy than not the dark souls isn't high fantasy but it's more grounded with more magic and everything i feel like is it looked like there was am i funny because of that specifically it looked like there was a little bit more magic and i think they're probably it sounds like they're like getting more forgiving on like allowing players to like have different options to play with like um, you get to customize your character in this one, which was something that oh, I, cool. not that I didn't enjoy it about Secro, but like something I like about Dark Souls, like when I make my character, it's like they have like their own set story, and I get very invested in like what I like what I'm doing with them and like who they are, and like that's like something I just do. Like, I don't like it's like I don't write it down, but it's like what I'm making, and I, like have like a backstory for them. Um, you so that's really good at D and D. I agree, but sorry. Um, but no, I'm very excited to like see ten page fucking backstory. What the weapons will be like. Um, I'm hoping there's like some really cool claymores because like I love like those are my favorite to play with. Like I like I usually go with like light armor and then just like a massive sword and then just like roll and like not worry too much about parrying because like like riposte in Dark Souls is significantly harder than it is in Secret. Like you can't just like spam it like in Secret you can just like press R1 over and over and over again and then like and then you get the block down. But then, like in Dark Souls, if you like, if you don't riposte, like, or it's called riposte, it's such like a neckbeard name for it. If you don't like parry, like at the perfect time, like you're fucked. That's why I never learned how to do it because I just rolled. All right, I'm ready. I'm ready if you guys are ready. Chuba dabba 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 hey. Talking about my best friend. You sound like you're singing. Hell yeah. Oh, good, fuck. Good ear. Whoops. Am I supposed to be watching some or am I doing? Nope. Okay. It will be in like two seconds. Yeah, you are. 
Oh wow, I am red as fuck. Hello. This, this one was, this oh, one was today. Oh, that's why. Let me guess, Ganon's back. I think it's Ganondorf. Yeah, sure, he's back, goddammit. It's always good. back. I thought it was, is it? I thought it was gonna be Ganondorf. I was gonna say it's gonna be. <laughs> you shall not pass? Yep. 2020. Okay. That's good. Alright. Okay. Um. Ganondorf? Yes. <laughs> That's the new form, is Ganondorf. <laughs> All right, uh, let one. me ask you guys, who's all played the first Breath of the Wild? Okay. Who beat it? Jack? I, I, I didn't beat it. This one, I, this one I thought you would have beaten. Okay, so Dakota, are you excited for this? Oh yeah, dude, I am a diehard Zelda fan. Um, is this something that you would want to stream, or Jack, were you looking to stream this? Uh, no, this would not be something I'm looking to stream. This is for, uh, yeah, I would say for me, this is probably a completely off stream. I, cause I, it, it's gonna be tons of hours of just walking around and collecting shit. I, this, I love doing that in the, in Blitz of Wild, the first one. Oh! I guess I'll, uh, anyone else, uh, anyone else into the, I don't know, Jeff, you don't even have a Switch. Ariel? Do you I like, are you gonna... have never touched a Zelda game in my life. All right, all right. I like don't. I understand how people feel about it because I feel the same way people feel about Zelda about other things. Oh like, yeah, absolutely. Sympathize, but like I have no, and I love the music because it often comes up in like my playlist. But... Oh, the 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 OG Link uh, or Zelda music is fucking. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, okay, so Dakota, what if? Me and you like tag. I'm just gonna fight everyone for these streams. streams. Oh, you. I mean, if you. No, I take wanted it, Dakota to. I was actually hoping Dakota would would stream this because. Okay, all right, uh, get some questions for you. Maybe it'll change my mind a little bit. What's gonna be different about this game than the first? Link Link me... loses his arm. <laughs> <laughs> it's now that she can sleep. Um, <clears throat> it's okay. it's gonna be a lot of more airborne stuff than there was in the first one because a lot of it that's, takes place in the that's it uh, I don't know I mean we, it gave it really the show didn't really give us much to go off but of what I mean what what do you think what do you think well, like what do they have to do to make this number two other than just I mean I heard some that you said it was the same map so we're, we're, we it's number two we're getting the same map I mean it's always taken place in Hyrule I mean it could be just a different you know something could have happened over 30 50 100 years that something happened to the current Hyrule and has now shifted or you know lost some areas that are now floating areas you know it could be certain castles instead yeah. of like that are on the ground that are now floating that you have to figure out a way to get to i mean you really know i mean it didn't give us a lot to go off I, th I think i need a little bit more because to me all right so like you know how assassin creed games are the same you know like they're the whoa, same whoa, but... Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> but but it's in a different fucking place. You know what I mean? So like, oh yeah, I'm sneaking around, I'm stabbing people, but it's in Brit British land Britain? Is that England? I think British land. It's in like England. I think British land is actually yeah. <laughs> is what they go by. On the map. Yeah. yeah. I have it right here. Uh yeah. 
Oh, or or uh, a Viking in Iceland. You know what I mean? To me, if I buy Breath of the Wild 2 and I, they drop me, Adults Gaming is here. What's up? Love the stream, guys. Love you. Adults Gaming, we love you. We love you. Thank you for hanging out. Uh, you know what I mean? Uh, like the same map. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go use the same fucking things to, to make some herbs and, and, and make my fucking lunch. I'm gonna go to the same spot. You know what I mean? Like the well, same thing. It could be, it could be just areas have been broken up or, you know, it's, it's gonna be. Is this the like, first? It's gonna be Hyrule, but different. Is this the first Zelda game that's set in like a, the same Hyrule? With there are the all same... different forms of Hyrule. Yeah, I know, but I'm saying like, is a. It, it, it looks similar to the first. Like, is this the first one in the same style? I mean, it's it's the same graphics, but we don't know if it's gonna be that same exact Hyrule. I would say if it were to be, that would this would be the first time, right? Hypothetically I think, speaking, I think so. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. I so hope said weapons don't take break. Place above Hyrule and floating, so it's all gonna be. So we have this whole new world that's gonna be as large as the first world. Because that was the thing that was the tits about the first Breath of Wild is this huge open world. And now I'm in the sky. I'm just, I, I don't, I'm kind of worried about it, man. You're not worried? No, it'll be amazing. I have never been failed by a Zelda game, and I played probably 95% of them. Where's the Harry Skyward Sword map, and, dude? You know, there's, there's a couple I didn't, but. Oh. Navu. Navi, right? Hey, Did, listen. If. What is it? If weapons don't break, and um, you know they're gonna break, Jack. It's the I, same game as the first one. Maybe, maybe they'll listen. I'm just saying my my wish list for it is like maybe like like Boku swords like those will break, but like the Triton you got from the water people. I can't remember their name right now. I agree. Yeah. Like that shouldn't break. Like I don't want to go all the way back there to fucking repair it. I think certain weapons shouldn't break, but like yeah, if you get like. Like same, like same. some stupid like yeah that'll break but if you, it, like like or like a guardian sword like I love the guardian weapons I I look they look really cool and like I never used them because I was like I'm gonna save this for later and then like never I, used it I have them all in my house I have them like on mountain yeah <laughs> on exactly like it's already. it's stupid that I had to like m like not use the swords I thought looked cool but I think the reason they did that in the first one is they wanted you to use other weapons they wanted you to like check I out get that weapons. but like at the same time. Play. I don't want to like. Let's say I find a sword I like. I don't want to break it. Like it's. I thought it was like because then it, it felt like. And then it felt like the only sword I would use was a master sword because, like, it wouldn't break. You know what I mean? Yeah, so but it's if you like have one heart gone. That master sword is a is a piece of shit. I mean. <laughs> yeah, I mean true, but like I don't know. Like, I just don't like things breaking. That, that was my complaint. So, you break my heart, Jack. I cared about that. Oh. <laughs> uh. So listen, we, uh, we're going into Zelda or, or uh, Breath of the Wild two. All that, all, all that shit I got in Breath of the Wild One, it's gonna carry over. I don't have to go up in the sky and be like, "Oh, I need a winter jacket because it's too you're, cold you're, up you're, here." You're, I already, you're I already got probably gonna shit. start over. That's my guess. Zelda. Yeah, it's Zelda, but right. it could be different. It could be different sets of armor. Yeah. Like I'm, I'm assuming you well, probably won't either. There'll be like it'll be a lot easier to obtain the first items that you needed to like maintain like cold areas but you're probably going to have to get like uh like different suits of armor for like you have to different get all areas. the different colored tunics in every other Zelda game yeah exactly I, now, know, I don't know if, I, I don't know if you're starting blood. blue or green in this one I think it looks like you're starting green yeah the, also the, his hair's down Jack... did you guys see that no, say it again. his hair's down it's not in little like he's like, like long hair now it's, he doesn't have like a hat or like he's not like in little ponytails. Like that's probably a little cu yeah. uh, customizable choice. Like no, <laughs> <laughs> maybe. What I'm saying with Jack's point is that if this is the first like number two that's taking place in the same world, and then I see this trailer, I just I mean I gotta know if it's gonna be a little bit different because Breath of the Wild one it was a huge game and it was exhausting to beat, but I did it. There's got to be a yeah. lot of standout points for this number two for me to get it. I'm going to be honest with you. I, I know it's like Breath of Wild 2, which it should sell itself. But you know what I mean? Yeah? No? I yeah. didn't think it was yeah. exhausting to, to beat, in my opinion. I actually, like, I thoroughly loved every second of playing that game. I personally, I, I had, the, the reason I didn't beat it is because there were moments of where, like, it was, like, I had other games I was playing, 
and I was like, oh, I'm loving this, I'm loving this, and then I would hit a wall of, like, I had to go all the way over there, and then, like, mm-hmm. and I'm not saying it's a bad thing, I'm sure everyone loved it, I, but, because like... Of, because I don't have the right clothing. But, like, I would get very upset with having to, like, run out of stamina and shit like that. Even in Genshin, I was like, fuck, I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna hurt someone. Like, I would get very <laughs> mad because, like, it's stupid. Like, it's a fucking video game, like, climb, but, like, yeah. I get it because it, it, you had to, like, level stuff up and like so i understand it and i'm not like dumb but at the same time like i just couldn't get past <laughs> some of the like some of the things i had to do i was like i'm not willing to put the time to do this right now yeah, like i'm I just not every i play every rpg the exact same is i go to every waypoint that i can physically get to and that's, that's I way smarter like, than what i do first hours so i can so i can okay cool now i can teleport here and go to this mission now i can teleport here assassin's creed uh Far Cry, uh, Zelda, all of them that have the, the waypoints that are like an open world setting, I hit all of them first. So, so finally a game that may take uh, uh, Dakota's attention to a level two and he doesn't want to stream I think that was so Biomutant. I'm kind of streaming it. I, oh, by me, yeah. I think yeah. Biomutant was the game I've seen him play the most. It's Rocket because League. he's on his A game. Well, I mean, you see all Rocket the content he's throwing on YouTube and Instagram. Ew! Uh, I mean, dude, I'll, I'll stream it. I mean, you know, but like, like I said, I like I, I play RPGs like a specific way in the beginning for a good ten hours of like going specifically. Here That's here, what here. I want. You guys are like, oh, people don't want to see this. They want to see the grind. They, they it, like. That's what I actually want us to do. I don't. I want you guys to think that's not a bad thing anymore. But real quick, uh, Michael said thoughts on Overwatch two. Uh, when is it coming out? Twenty-five. And when is it coming out? Twenty twenty-five. <laughs> It's gonna oh, come out the real. same day Elder Scrolls Six, and then. Don't worry, guys. We got, we got, we, we gotta look at what, got uh, what Baptiste looks like. That was our big E3 moment. <laughs> Sombra has thicker hair. Oh, and Sombra, I forgot about that. And then you can see the she nose. Has more layers in her hair. And you can cancel um, Reinhardt's charge. Dude, that is so broken. Yeah, if they don't buff yeah, other, if they don't buff other <laughs> tanks, Reinhardt is meta. Like if you have two fire strikes and you can cancel your charge, that's well, stupid. Have to buff every other tank. There's no way you can go solo hmm. tank with the way. I just, is. I think Winston's little sniper rifle gun is stupid. Like I need something else. Like I think it's cool, but, but one either. That's, just, that's one change. They're gonna have others. You can maybe you have. I have. I have forget. my faith in Blizzard. Like gone. Don't. Don't you say that yet, because guys, they're very much working on how the bullets sound. That's that really did you hear the bullets in the train station? I know we all watched that. Yeah. It sounded they're, different they're though when they were outside. Ninety-five percent of the resources when they were outside, bullets and rifles. It sounded sound. more less loud, and then inside, it sounded boomier. Did you hear that? Yeah, yeah. What up, Davidson? All right, Jack, roll the next clip. Let's go. This is the last one, unless anyone else has any other games. Well, I, I have one more that I wanted to add. Oh, no, that. wait, never mind. Wait, no, we have Redfall and... There's, yeah, yeah, there's two oh, more, I, so I three more. One, one, I actually okay. have one that I wanted you to add, and I'll... I'll, I'll oh, wait, fuck which me. one are you saving for last? Because have John give you the other one before that. Because I bet the one you're saving for last is the best one. The, list, the, best one. the next one... Fuck me, then, I guess. Uh, <laughs> the next one, Starfield, yeah. is what we're watching. I'll, I'll throw it on after this. Okay. We're saving Redfall for last. Let's watch Redfall first. Yeah, I was gonna say Starfield is the big one for me. All right, so go start, go, uh, or wait, go Redfall and then go Battlefield 2042 (laughs) and then end on Starfield. Uh, Oh, Battlefield's gonna be You fucking barf emoji (laughs) over there. You can't even play a first person shooter except for Valorant. I'm very good. I I can kill you in a first person shooter with. Where's the corner to hide from? Where's the corner? You don't even play Valorant. You're out in the real world. All right, all right, all right. Watch the trailer. Watch the trailer. Watch the trailer. I challenge you. (laughs) John already sounds like he knows how to play Counter Strike. Yep. (laughs) Yeah, right. (laughs) What up, chat? I think they based that dude off of an actor that I know. So, in my uh, head. that was fun, right? That's your cue, mate. Oh, shit. Sleep tight. You know what this reminds me of? My boy, the Himalayan. Get 
they can't kill you anytime they want? Hey, asshole. We got him. What is he doing in that day? In the field, the Red Fall, Massachusetts. Behind me, we are witnessing clear signs of cult activity as the locals engage. Hey! What? I really hope the video was worth it. Everybody, fall back! People need to know what happened. Oh, that's fucking sick. Shit right there. Jacob, there's something. That one goes through on its own. Oh shit. Jeff's gonna love this one. You better have a plan, Jacob. Yep. Don't miss. See? You yell don't miss before you shoot, you don't miss. Mm -hmm. It'd be a lot more cringy. He was like, I never miss. <laughs> Rifle shot. I'm in love with this little robot. Look, she actually had a Valorant uh, skin for her gun. <laughs> that, she got that Reaver shit. Yeah. That's the first thing I thought, too. <laughs> What is this game? Things will ever go back to normal. Would you want to go back to normal? Not if I still have to pay my student loans. Oh, shit. Uh... What? Red Bull? At Xbox? It's a game pass, baby, because it's Bethesda. Mm -hmm. It's Xbox? It's Bethesda. Yeah. It's Bethesda. Oh shit! I'm gonna have to get an Xbox, dog. I learned to play on a computer. Taco Bell now. On PC. Okay, okay, okay. Obviously, we're all kind of interested in this. Only one of us has an Xbox, Dakota. It's on you... PC. How many times are gonna say it's, it's on, on PC? PC too? You're the only one who can't play, John. Well, Actually, you probably could, but you, you can <laughs> play on your laptop. You just refuse to use your laptop for anything but Streamlabs. I will not ever. Exactly, we know. <laughs> it's uh, not play some fun games. Let's. Okay, okay, sorry, I'm just excited. To answer your excited. question, which I know you're gonna ask, yes, I'm gonna play it because it has it's Bethesda and vampires. Okay, so right there, that's what we like to call a cinematic. <laughs> right? No. Mm -hmm. uh, Jack hates himself. <laughs> <laughs> um, what, what are we thinking the gameplay is like? I mean, is it like a new age Outriders, but versus vampires and shit, or what? I'm thinking more. Has anyone heard anything about how the gameplay is? I yeah, I was I got more Borderland just because they have like set characters. Mm -hmm. Unless you can make your own, but I got the vibe that it, we, we, we're supposed to get invested in these characters. I think we're getting set characters. Yeah. Those four, yes, and yes. I'd be okay with that too because they were all very cool. But I think it'll be more like a 
Borderlands vibe. And it could be co-op. I'm guessing Left 4 Dead. I'm pretty sure they said it was going to be co-op. I'm guessing it's Left Left 4 Dead. Dead. I'm pretty sure they said it will be co-op or you can play by yourself. Oh, yeah, we got to watch that too, James. We do have to watch that. We got to throw in Far Cry 6. I forgot. That's a huge one. Oh, yeah. Um, Okay. Uh, I guess we can talk about this more when we get gameplay, but just from the cinematic, John John Light. Yeah. John John never going to play. Too bad John John can't play. He can. He can. <laughs> he just won't. Oh, he won't. Out. Yeah, he, he won't. can. He won't. John John gonna watch the four of us play together. Yep. Good thing there's four characters. Yep. <laughs> oh fuck me. Uh, yeah. Th- th- this looks awesome. I didn't even know this existed. Vampires, I'm such a slot far, but I mean, if I don't even, I just don't even know. There's so much. It looks cool too, because I I don't think all the enemies are vampires. I think some of them are like in the cult, and like there's probably be like bosses. I didn't, I didn't, I haven't read anything about it. I just watched the trailer, but it looked really cool. That's what I love about E3 when you get these games. Like obviously, like the only game I came in here looking forward to is Elden Ring. And then, like, I kind of, like, expected companies to, like, talk about games they'd already talked about. But there's always some cool games that, like, you didn't know were coming out. Like, it, like, announced or, like, a new IP or um, something like that. It always makes me excited to, like, watch E3. Fuck yeah. Everybody yeah, yeah, yes, Army. They, 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 stuff Left 4 Dead. Absolutely. Oh, yes, Party Animals. I'm party really excited. Animals. That's just I a reskin Gang Beast. I don't care. I want to do it. It looks violent and awesome. This is gameplay. You want to go watch the... Oh, I'm going to go get my ice cream. I'll be right back. <laughs> Attention all squads. The Russian troops are falling back. Do whatever you can to secure the sector. We push them back, but not far enough. Do not let them regroup. Titanfall 4. (laughs) (laughs) That's pretty sick. But it's not Battle Royale, but like there's other environmental shit going on. Yeah, there's it's all like team based. Oh, that's fucking awesome. Oh, Oh my god. There's no story or anything. I know. Which is fine because the multiplayer in Battlefield is my favorite anyway. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm shit, excited that's for this. Yeah, this is fucking awesome. sick. Modified mid game. Yeah. Oh, did like you guys ever play <laughs> What's the Cops and Robbers Battlefield? The, uh... Battle Battle line? Four, right? Battle? Yeah, Hardline, Hardline. Hardline? Yeah. This is what this is reminding me a little bit of. Shit that you have no idea when are gonna happen and where they spawn. Oh look, it's the thing. All right. <laughs> Brother. Holy. Jeff, are you into, I know that you are into Call of Duties, because we have played many of times. Are you one to be into the Battlefields as well? No campaign, I'm out. Oh, it's like that. Mm -hmm. It's like that. Well, I didn't play Black Ops 4. I didn't play Black Ops 4, no campaign. 
But Black Ops 1 was strictly Battle Royale, wasn't it? Oh, they had a multiplayer. Oh, no, they did have a multiplayer. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Well, nice. Blackout um, didn't come out for like almost uh, a year after the game. Came out. Ariel, no, she got ice cream during this middle finger. Go fuck myself. John, I think this uh, is just me and you. <laughs> yeah, I'll, Jack, I, yeah, I don't. All right, but uh, Dakota, yeah or no? 100%. I, I I played a lot of uh, three and four, and I played a, a shit ton of one. And I one was the best my favorites. I, I one was good. I I love the newer age like aircrafts and things like that. Like I love the jets. Like the planes are fun, but I love flying a jet. So I hope they make this multiplayer like four, but with one tactics. Yeah, because one had some of the smoothest like all out war that that game mode was phenomenal and then you remember how they brought out the behemoths and stuff mm -hmm. yeah if you if your team was Whatever losing team you got the behemoth bad, yeah. what if the tornadoes are like the oh, behemoth for sure. yeah because so I mean, like be you're handy. on this side and you're losing they send the tornado on the on the winning sides team yeah you know what i mean that would be fucking so the, one of the big sellers for me is like i love that battlefield always has the uh destructible environments uh, and I love, bro. I love the the cities. Like that's what mm -hmm. I love about three and four was your. It was always in big cities that you got to destroy. It of like you can destroy buildings whole fall. buildings. Yeah. yeah, I remember it was three, and I literally I remember one specific building it was the biggest building on, on on one of the maps. I can't remember because it's been so long. But yeah, yeah, yeah. I me and uh, like I watched just a bunch of us like not even t try to kill the team because like it was like day two it came out. We literally were just destroying this building. Like we're shooting shit into the building, <laughs> just yeah. to watch the whole building collapse. It was like I was. It was the coolest. Because it thing will, and that's what's yeah. fucking awesome about it. Uh, yeah, I'm super excited about it. I hope to see a little bit more about what the gameplay offers. That that modification, like during been, gameplay, yeah, was yeah. fucking sick. Like on the uh, fly. Yeah, I I think that's gonna be very very cool. Uh, how what what did Starfield last? But I think we sh I think we should do the Far Cry Six. Yeah, do Far Cry trailer. Six and Starfield. Yes. Scooby Doo. Please, we have to get on that boat. Abuela, what the hell I'm gonna do with baseball cards? Do you have any idea what these are worth? Let us through! Oh, oh, yeah. Marco! Always making new friends. Danny, you're late. Where's Alejo? He gave up his ticket. For his family. Bullshit! Alejo is an orphan. Alejo's not going anywhere anymore. Come on, Marco. Let them on. Vamos. Good man. Get out of here! Let us on! Then do this. Gracias. Don't worry about it, Chamaco. Here, it's all I've got. This isn't right, Danny. We should be fighting, not running to the Yankees. Alejo gave you a fucking gift, Lira. We survive. Same as the orphanage, same as the academy. What's that? No, no, this is a fishing boat. You're real, no, no! Oh, shit. El Presidente. Me papa love to fish. We would go out on a boat, just like this. And we would catch the fish, and then release them. He would say, it's not always about your stomach, mijo. It's about the challenge. Except when he caught a big, fat, juicy marlin. Ha! <laughs> he was too proud to let that fish go. Oh no. 
I've caught a very big fish today. Haven't I, Diego? Diego! Oh, shit. It was Diego. No way. I have caught you, mijo. Now it's time to bring you home. I don't want this anymore, Papa. We have no choice. Let them go. They can work. Make vivido. Truth or lies? Truth. They could be good workers. They could help rebuild paradise. But if you wanted them to live, you would have never set foot on this fucking boat. Oh, shit! Ten years old. And Diego has such compassion for his people. These fish, we will catch and release. Is one of those the main character? Nope. talking to you on this one because you have mained uh how many far cries have you beaten on the channel uh didn't beat one and two so that's it so the three four i don't think i on the channel i didn't do blood dragon but I have you blood but dragon. but i have seen blood dragon because you shoved you were like blood dragon and that's the first time i was like holy shit this is this is that's a dlc right or is that its own standalone standalone okay um so you've done what four it's three four five new dawn and primal five yeah yeah awesome okay so how excited are you for this i am very excited for this one not I'm many afraid. things get just pp going you just saw chorizo it's amazing <laughs> One of my favorite parts I'm looking forward to. And Little there's some. Puppy? Yeah, Dachshund. Did you. Did you. I don't think Ariel saw it. Saw oh, what? The did dog? you see the little dog with the fucking. Yes, where do you think oh. I was? Because I, I would have thought you would have been like, ah! Oh, I, I didn't know. I didn't know. I, 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 I didn't know. I, I didn't know. I didn't know. I didn't. I mean, I do have I, a question, it, it, though, because I've never played Far Cry. Are they, are they connected, the narratives, like the stories from all the games? No? no, well, five and New Dawn. New Dawn were, yeah. That's okay. it. And and really, New Dawn is just like a reskin. Is of it like five. five years after or something, or a couple? Yeah, years it after. could have been a DLC, honestly. It was yeah. still connected. It really could have. Like I've seen the gameplay, I just didn't know if any of the characters were like interconnected or anything. Story wise, um, was. but the cool thing is, is along the way you get different animals to become your like right hand man. And what do you think this little Dotson's gonna do? Jeff, do you think he's gonna? I hope they, because they always do crazy. I want him to put like a nuclear bomb <laughs> attached to him or something. Mini his, nuke. His special ability is gonna be to steal my heart. <laughs> <laughs> you only, you, you're only allowed. You can only pet him. That's all you can do. You just pet him. I don't even care. <laughs> he licks your face and you get yeah. some health back. Oh, there you oh, go. Oh shit. Not too uh, bad. Okay, so uh, I think you get. Uh, when is cool. this? Is this dropping next year or this year? This year. Uh, October? Yes. Or September. October. I, I think it's October 21st yeah. or 22nd. Dude, I'm going to have a good birthday. Those. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'll be pre-ordering that one with the season pass. Oh, yeah, me too. Sheesh. Ricardo, are you in the Far Cries? Oh, 100%. I didn't I've, 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 know. We're, we're I've, learning I've about beat, each I've other on these five podcasts. five on stream. Huh? I beat five on stream. Oh, you did. You did. Well, so you know, did Jeff. Okay. So did me. Yeah, you, so, don't, you, don't, you don't watch my streams. You're usually at work. It's okay. Dakota, uh, I'm the only was, one that watches the stream by the night because I got He wasn't working when, though. Uh, 
<laughs> no, I'm I I personally Far Cry uh, is it's dear to my heart because I always play with friends and it's usually me and Sean that fucking uh, play all the way through with each other and we just do the stupidest shit together and it's it's it, I, it's so much fucking fun. We'll fly the oh, helicopter that's and just right. drop bombs. I or, remember now you guys were running yeah. the like uh, you'd beat the game and you were doing the the extra shit together. Yeah, yeah. I, I, there's a couple fun. times where I remember I'll never forget this. Like he was like, all right, you, uh, give me like five minutes. I gotta get to the restroom. So we're on a bridge. It was this is Far Cry Four. On a bridge, and he has, it's like that little single person, or like it's like a single person helicopter, like it's a really small yeah. helicopter. Yeah, and yeah. he was landed, but he was still in the helicopter, like ready to take off. So I, <laughs> I, I dr- grabbed like I think four or five vehicles and drove like basically on top of the helicopter, and I put like a C4 on a couple surrounding ones, and I was just literally <laughs> waiting right outside the bridge, it was like. He's like, all right, I'm back. I was like, oh, cool, watch this. Boom. <laughs> it just exploded all the – it was – dude, I, that's that's why I love these kind of games. I, I, right. They're so much fun. Oh, uh, <laughs> I, I, I'm, I'm very excited for this game. I have played all the Far Cries. I think they're great. I think New Dawn – New Dawn, right? Um, uh, you know, whatever. It wasn't the best, but – it was all right. Uh, I, I'm very excited about this. Very, very excited. It, it's one of those characters that was under, that was one of the main characters, right? I think Danny was the one. Sure. Yeah, okay, I, I think I, you I'm... can you can choose a male or a female to start as. Okay. I think. I think. All right. Definitely. So um, super excited for. Yeah. Okay, I believe. Going. I'm excited that we have Giancarlo Esposito as the fucking main villain. I he plays yes. such a good villain, like from uh, Breaking Bad, from um, uh, Mandalorian. Yeah. He's amazing. He's amazing. From The Boys. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I forgot. Holy shit, I forgot about that. Yeah. He is like the villain of all villains right now. So mm-hmm. um, I'm very intrigued in that role. I believe we have one more left. Yep. Jack uh, Starfield. If you want to get that going, and then we'll, um, and then I'll go back to the etching. Thank you. Perfect. After the trailer. Yep. Oh, I didn't know. They made Skyrim. You didn't know that? Watch the trailer. Watch the trailer. Did someone hit him? Okay. Oh wait, no, no, no. First of all. Oh, I didn't know that this was Pause Bethesda. It. It's, of course it's Bethesda. I didn't what? know that. How did Sorry. you know this? I didn't, Ariel, know, Ariel, I didn't even know what Starfield is. I don't even know no. what Starfield is. Ariel, the, question, the answer is we are gaming, maybe not so much on. Bitch, I got 47 million games. I was like, can, can we look at this? The <laughs> A brand me. new universe, 25 oh, years 25 in years, the making. Yes. Oh my god. Because they've all been focused on, on Elder Scrolls and Fallout series. 25 years. As old as me. I love my balls. Fuck you. We're still going. An Xbox exclusive too? Yep. They say, or the wonder PC. is, not that the field of stars is so vast, <laughs> but that we have measured it. You're part of Constellation now, part of our family. What you've found, it's the key to unlocking everything. Oh, shit! This is all we've been working towards. We've come to the beginning of humanity's final journey. Prepare for departure. Graviton loop array for check. To discover what's out there. Chills. John doesn't know what that date is either. That's its release date. 
Yeah, but do you know the significance of it? 11, 11, 22. Um, if I say no, will you call me stupid? I can't wait to get there and kill you. I'll help you. Where and is the... <laughs> um, go forward, yeah. I think. It's No, wait, it's, that's yeah, 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 yeah. I think it's there. They might zoom. It's right no. when he pulls, right when he pulls, yeah, when he pulls it forward, right there, right there, it's right there, right there. Wait, right. back a little bit. I don't know if it is there. It's, it's right, right here. here. No, it's right there. You can see it. It's it's just like it's not. What am I looking not, at? So, yep, so, right it's there. Okay, the... hold on. Wait. Can you yeah. sh can you like use your pointer on screen? You have to go back a little. Right. Pause. Yep, yeah. Right there. There you go. Yep. So you can get it. Right what? here. Oh, don't worry, John. What are we looking? For? You figure. don't even. You didn't even. How did you, you can know see it. I was talking about this at the beginning before we started? I was like, there's a big Elder Scrolls reveal and start yeah. in, in the and you were like, oh cool, like. So like this, right. you can't see it as well because like, it's a little bit grainy because of the stream on Discord. But Ugh. it's this yeah. like etching right here on the metal, like is almost an exact like replica of the map of Hammerfell, which is a mm. region in Elder Scrolls. In, in Tamriel. I still don't know where we're looking at. Um, right. I I, I can't, can't I can't no, show you. At. I can't. Okay, so I can't like show Either. you. I'm putting on, it in the chat. On Facebook, I'm showing you right now, but like, I can't show you on Discord right now. So you actually can see it. Tell me where to look. Am I looking at his hand? No, it's on the side of the metal of the thing. Go look on the, the side of Facebook the metal screen. of the thing. Yeah, All it's in, like it says, if I go up, it says landing a a o t. No, 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 no. no. Yeah, the, the landing a o t. If you go down, oh, there's smudge. three screws. Yeah, yeah, smudge. That exact smudge. Yeah. It looks if like you a look smudge. on well, the Facebook on screen, the, Jack has his arrow on it. On the actual like. Cause like Discord, we can only stream. That's in. what y'all seen. Yeah. If you Sean. zoom in on it and then look at the map I of Hammerfell. A tweet with a, it's a, it's the map of Hammerfell, which in 2018 they did a reveal that one little clip and that they just it, saw some land and the everyone setting, was like, "That's Hammerfell. That's yeah. Hammerfell." And then this is con confirmation. We all think that it's going to be Hammerfell for Elder Scrolls Six. Well. So. Anyways, it's gonna be amazing. Yes, can we talk about this game? Yeah, I'm let's go back to out. the thing with the stuff. <laughs> Jeff, I thought I was the only one that was like, Durp! Yeah, yeah, I have no idea. I'm just following it. Well, you did know that it was made by people who like fall out of Skyrim. Probably well, I haven't thought about it for look, ten years. <laughs> like, I I had no idea what this game was about. So, someone tell me what the f is this? It's gonna be. Skyrim in space, in a sense. That's how they've described it as Skyrim. Is is all those R different R choices, R all those different things you do. It's it's gonna be. So that. what's the difference between this and Outer Worlds? Those so that's Skyrim what's really space. interesting. I was actually gonna bring that up because I played Outer Worlds because I missed Bethesda producing anything for so long that like Outer Worlds felt like taking me home to like what we were, like say New Vegas was, and like I really missed that. But this is going to be like it's taking. Like out, I think, I think it was that was meant to be like a like kind of like nostalgic and make you feel like you stepped back in time and like experienced the games that we like all used to enjoy. And it was like sure it was like modern and like well done, but like I think this game is going to be like a whole new level of like I don't know. It's the first gaming. new game yeah. that Bethesda has done like it said in, in 25 years like it's not Fallout it's not Skyrim it's not Skyrim. Elder Scrolls I mean um, it's yeah. not it's like new a... we did Starmie that was the first one we played is Outer Worlds not new? Outer Worlds not Bethesda it's not by them it was by it's the by people Obsidian. who did New Vegas and Obsidian oh, left they Obsidian. got fought. Bethesda fired there was a whole big rift between them and Obsidian left and became their own develop like game developing mm -hmm. company and so that like was big thing about that coming out was like people were really excited about it because it was the people that they really liked who did the original Bethesda games. This is like a whole new and but uh, 25 yeah. years in the making means that they probably did have a hand in it at some point. But yeah, this is going to be Three. incredible. Three. A whole new experience. That's why I can't even predict, like even I'm saying Skyrim in space doesn't click for me because I think it's going to be a whole oh, new yeah. experience. It's a whole different experience. Like, I can't amazing. even yeah, like I don't like think they, it's they use to any Skyrim. Games. They use Skyrim just as a backbone to create this whole new fucking. 
Well, it's just give, it's giving you as a as a player like an idea of what to have the smallest little aspect of like to understand what this is going to be. I think the big tell was like the from the creators of Skyrim and Fallout Four. There, I think that's kind of like a tone setter. And, yeah, yeah. They don't make they don't make not that kind of games. Uh, okay. I think uh, in scale Jack. it's going to be way bigger than either. Okay. Jack, are you um interested in this game? Yes. I put a ton of time into Skyrim. I, so, for like Bethesda, Morrowind is the first game I ever played in my life, ever, video game wise. Nice. So, like, Bethesda has a very close place to, in my heart, and like, I follow their games religiously, and I look for the hints. I firmly believe in the theory that all of their universes are interconnected. Are you, um, are you so, going like, to stream this game? I don't know yet. I would love to stream it, but I think I need to play oh, through. What's going no, on? We no, got people listen, that love these I games think... but don't want to stream. Jack no, don't want to stream that. I think I need to, to play that. through don't want to stream it. privately so I can masturbate a little bit. And then... <laughs> well, masturbate <laughs> off camera and then come back and stream it. Just point. stream a little bit. Well, okay, no, I will a... stream it. No, I will. I just don't know if I'm going to stream it immediately. I might want to like experience the beginning. I think everyone will be able to. I, I was out. just gonna say, just to put that yeah. out there, this is a game that we're all gonna be able to stream because there's gonna be so many different yes. paths to take, just like Cyberpunk and there's gonna be so more much that Cyberpunk. Has seen. Yep. Yeah, but every stream will be different with new stuff. So you know how you know how I look for people to main games right now. What 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 Ariel just said. Marlon was the first game she ever played. This place holds a heart. You know, it's in her heart. For her to stream this game would be perfect sense but, but i'm not i, I also I stream it i don't want to take it from anyone else is my point like i, I don't know that you're you're not but anyway but uh, that's dope. uh jeff is this a game that you may be into um uh, I, I probably i'll have to wait and see like no what, idea what if, what if it's that the intro to returnal <laughs> and you just and you've just ended up playing <laughs> you returnal. play as every, the space man game. This is this is this is you playing I'm as the spaceman. I can't wait to get hit by a car like my way to work one day and just wake up back at my desk here like mid podcast like. <laughs> oh my! What if your returnal was just a day at work and you couldn't kill yourself? You see, Jeff? No, not again. I've seen this before. Oh, Dakota! Obviously, you're very excited for this. I will definitely be streaming this, even if no, if everybody else is streaming, because this is a game that we're all gonna come and fucking play. But we can tag team this one, kind of like Cyberpunk. Well, it'll, so. it'll be like one of those things. More so, I think Cyberpunk is more story driven than like I didn't even play the main thing. Like I, the main campaign for Skyrim was the last thing I did. Like yeah. if you were to watch me play it for someone else, like I went off to go do my own. I, I literally like there was like okay, go to this town. And I was like, nope, fuck you, and then like ran wherever I wanted yeah. to go. That's how I played Cyberpunk. Nope, I'm not going there. I, I, I play, I mean, I did so many side quests on Cyberpunk. It was like, play the main story. Like the devs had a secret thing that came down. It was like, keep going, fucker. Like, <laughs> I he just keeps side quests. resetting his point with Pan Am. He just kept like replaying that save file. He never, oh, yeah. he never got oh, to where right. I got. I was the first one to actually get the hook of Pan Am. Is it true? Yeah, Ari- I, for- I forget that it disappeared from Ariel's hard drive. Or- Don't yeah, worry, Ariel. Insane. It's coming She's back. It's, it's coming back. No, that was so crazy. I like I and I wrote to them multiple times. I emailed. I tweeted at everything. I was like, I never requested a refund for this game, and no one ever responded. They just ever. say sorry. They just took the game from me. Oh. I don't even know if I still have my saves. Like I don't know. Um, but um, yeah, I, but I. There's you so many back comments trying to catch up. I know, but I'm like, I, I don't know if it's worth playing on PS4. Don't ever <laughs> do this it. Point. Just, it's gone. The game's gone. The game's gone. It had a chance. The, but, I'm, um, I'm ready for Cyberpunk 4088. Or whatever. I will stream I will stream this game. I didn't realize. I thought there was going to be a oh, fight God. for it, so I will happily take on the first stream. I will just be a mess. I will probably be crying. Listen, it's, 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 it's not content. a it's, What we try to do is we try – it's synergy. It's yeah. it's what games are are better suited for this person that has the available software that also has the the love for the game. It's a whole lot of things. Oh, but I, I may like buy an see... Xbox too, by the way. 
I, I, I think I might have to get one. I, I just need Skoda to win me one from Taco Bell. You just gotta play your fucking PC, goddamn it. You can use a controller. Yeah, you I, will, have dude, it. I will literally <laughs> take this PC and break it right now just so I don't have to fucking play it, okay? No, you won't. Then yeah, you wouldn't no. be able to do podcasts. You wouldn't be able to stream at all. Hey, fair. Y'all called me out on a bluff. <laughs> the heart. Uh -huh. anyway, when, I, when I come down, I'm, I'm literally going to download a bunch of games and just play them on John's so laptop. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you make this shit run slower, oh, I'm going to pick you up. I don't think you can make it run slower. <laughs> Jesus, you sound like my dad. <laughs> I got 10 emails. Oh, yeah. Why is it because you're so slow? Yeah, good. No, how do I download more RAM? Why does it keep popping up? Darmy, we did cover Outer Worlds 2 at the beginning. That was I, our other I, favorite. I thought we did. Hey, oh, listen. Okay. Uh, this has been a fun podcast. We're 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 getting better. We're getting uh, it's smoother. We're we're doing trailers. We're doing gaming. Uh, tra it, it's good. It's good. We're we, I'm having a lot of fun these past couple podcasts. And I just want to say I'm grateful for everybody watching, everybody in this podcast with me. Happy anniversary for three years. I'm gonna take a shot real quick before oh, I cry wow. myself to sleep. John, John, take a shot. I decided not to drink again tonight, Jeff. Yeah, I'm proud of you. The old uh, still sticking to dry February, huh? Uh, yeah, I've been sober for negative sober February. <laughs> sober uh, February, still going strong. It's crazy to me, you know. Like when you have a when you have a dream, and like it starts somewhere. You have this thing that starts, and in my brain, so I had done two podcasts before. Is this your I have a dream one. Speech? One was a winner. One was like really good, um, and then I went to this piece of shit. I'm just kidding. And then, uh, that one went well. The second one was good. We were getting traction, but we fell out a little bit too early. And then I, I just w I had always been like wanting to do another podcast. And then I met Jeff, and Jeff changed my life. His knowledge. So I, I, I like have a lot of knowledge, but it's because there's different levels to everything. I have a huge passion and knowledge for like top to this amount of level of detail with shit. Jeff filled in all underneath, on top, around. I mean, we would just sit around while I was bartending and he'd be drinking all the Jaeger and we would just talk about movies and games for hours. I, I, if he didn't come in, I hated my shift, but he was always there. So it was great. Jeff, and then- why did you come back? <laughs> He was like, you're finally someone tipped me at Monkey Pants. By the way, a huge shout out to <laughs> Sean Moleman with the hundred million train. star drop. Oh, good lord, a train. You ran a train? You ran a train? Oh, good lord. Shetto. Choo choo. Yeah. Um, whoa, dude, whoa, Moleman. What? We love what? you, dude. Thank you so Holy much. Shit. I haven't seen uh, a Moleman train in a while. Mm -mm. It's just still going. Anyway. I like the appreciation tag that goes with it, though. I don't know what that is. But uh, I love the appreciate it. Facebook is running a um, appreciation uh, thing right now, where we get like certain amount of stars back, awesome. like we, like they they like, oh, match me. or something. There's awesome. like something going on. Yeah. So then, so then oh. I just I started loving Jeff in a different way, and then I were we were you across the bar from me when I said, "Hey, let's do the podcast." Yeah, I wanted to be on. The other side. Well, I didn't know if we were like partying together at that point, or if, if this was a thing that I was like, "Hey, bud, let's take this relationship to the next step." Annabelle hey, with the hundred stars, thank you so much. No, Holy it was shit. it was at my pants. And then you're like you're like I do this podcast, but you're like, but I want to do. Oh, was I still doing the old podcast when I met yeah. you? Yeah, you're doing Blast from Podcast. Oh my god! You homebreaker, okay. Jeff. So you, you So anyway, so I met Jeff and I was like, fuck these other guys. <laughs> just kidding. Somehow that fills it out because it was it was a good podcast. It's just it was tough to keep up with that content because it was strictly like eighties. You're, you're all night you were nineties. Yeah, I was so not it was like nineties and I was 90s. like, How many times can we mention family matters or Man, home damn. improvement? Oh my god, did Jean I Claude. do that? Jean Claude Van Damme. <laughs> Ninja Turtles, one, two, three. Yeah. yeah. So me and Jeff started the podcast, and then uh, here we we go a little bit in time, and then I start working at Ice Den, and 
I meet this fella named Jack, and he comes up, and he's got a little sparkle in his eye, and a little... <laughs> he wasn't in school at the time. That went away fast. <laughs> and I have this dead inside. But, uh, yeah. I, think, uh, I think I was just like... You killed that fast. GG, yes. GG, GG, So... Uh, so I, 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 I just remember, I think I was like, was like Overwatch and then Jack showed up like right next to me. He's like, did you mention Overwatch? <laughs> I was like, what's up, man? And then we just talked about Overwatch for too long. Like I'd see Katie being like, this motherfucker better get back to work. And I'd be like, you better get back to work, bitch. That's why you're about to get fired. Cause you don't do shit. Anyway, uh, we would talk about Overwatch forever. And then we had him on episode nine. Ish, Jack. Um, it was before ten because I was on for the tenth one, as well. Yeah. And then Dakota sparkled his fucking ass up in here, and then Ariel just showed up. She's like, "I'm here. I'm gonna do. I'm um, and everything. Y'all got no fucking choice. I'm here. I'm gonna wear this motherfucking <laughs> hat and these headphones. I won from a TGS giveaway." <laughs> I, literally all of my stuff is from winning TGS's giveaways and I was like all right now I'm in give me all free stuff and I can scream all the phone to it I'm just saying I love how it starts as a spark in someone's dream and then people come together for the same thing and I just want to say I love you all thank you cheers uh happy anniversary three years everyone uh, everyone that's watching stars uh, uh, Um, it's, it's ice cream bite. <laughs> it's so usual, melted, it's like the, a shot. The usual Jack of uh, <sighs> none. Nothing. <laughs> the lack of sparkles anyway, from Jack. I love you guys, and I appreciate you. That's all I got. This is an awesome episode. We have a lot to build on. I feel like every episode is getting better and better. So we'll see you next week. Uh, news announcement. We will all be together for July 4th for a couple days. So you guys are going to get some real content coming soon. Until then, this is GGS. We, we love everything. Yeah, it's going to be good. The entire it's going to be good. I'm gonna Thank die. you. Someone all the supporters, die. all the star senders, all the people who hang out with us day after day, followers, mods, team. Peace out.